Okay, and what more better way to usher in the holidays with a little bit of rom-com movies and Netflix's first LGBTQ-centered holiday film, Single All the Way. Check it out. You got me a down best. Merry Christmas. Thank you. Aren't y'all breaking the rules? I thought the whole point of this was to keep presents a secret from each other. Rules are meant to be broken, especially when it comes to insane rules that make zero sense. <laughs> Why are we all in separate Single rooms? Single All the Way is set to start streaming on Netflix in just two days, and Jennifer Robertson is one of the leads in this ensemble cast and joins us live now on CP24 Breakfast. Uh, Jennifer, great to have you with us. I love your hair right now as I'm seeing it. So much different than Jocelyn on Schitt's Creek, and of course, you play Lisa in this new movie. Uh, there's a bit of history in the making because this is the first LGBTQ rom-com made by Netflix. So tell us how you came to be on this project and your role as Lisa in this film. Uh, I'm thrilled to be part of this project. Um, when my agent asked me if I wanted to be a part of it, I was 100% I want to be a part of this. And then every day I would find out the cast and my mind was blown when I heard Kathy and Jimmy and Jennifer Coolidge and Michael Urey. And I get to play Michael's intense sister, which is, um, is pretty fun. <laughs> and of course, uh, Michael Urey saying that there is not a person on this cast who is not funny. You mentioned some of the names there. Now, we all know Jennifer Coolidge. Uh, she's been uh, called a comedic genius by him. And she, of course, best known as Stifler's mom, Janine, on American Pie. What was it like working with her? She, she's hysterical. She's kind and giving, but she's just, I don't know. She's one of those people. She doesn't have to be saying anything or even doing anything. And she's still making you laugh. The whole working with Jennifer was just trying to not ruin the take because she was making you laugh. Yeah. She's <laughs> And, of course, Kathy uh, Najimny from Sister Act. I loved her in Sister Act and Hocus Pocus. Was she just as fun to work with as well? She was. She's so... Kathy is so playful and mischievous. And from day one, it was like, what antics can we do to entertain ourselves? Day one, we were like, let's see how many Nespresso pods we can steal from this kitchen set. <laughs> and she had one in her bra. Oh, wow. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, and Jennifer, let's talk a bit about this movie, Single All the Way. So Michael Yuri is the perpetually single male. He wants to come home for the holidays. And tell us what happens, because he kind of gets his best friend slash roommate, played by Philemon Chambers, to come along and be his pretend boyfriend. But things take a turn, right? Well, well, he doesn't take the turn. The family makes things take a turn. Ah. We <laughs> adore um, his friend, we adore Nick, and we feel like we can see something that the two of them as friends haven't been able to see. So there's a bit of um, Christmas magic and trying to um, make them see something different in one another that they hadn't seen before. Right, and of course, uh, Michael Yuri's mother, uh, played played by Kathy Najimny, right, encourages him to fall for the hot her hot fitness trainer, played by a Luke McFarlane. Now, what what I think is really special about this film is that all the uh, characters, the gay characters, are played by gay actors, and this is important for representation. It's absolutely important, and I think it's important to start making more rom-coms and Christmas movies that are telling all kinds of love stories as well. And that was part of my interest in the project is this diversity. I mean, we have, we have a lot of hetero rom-coms. We could fill that warehouse at the end of Raiders of Lost Ark with hetero rom-coms. So it is about diversity and showing all kinds of love. And um, Luke was so, he's so sweet in the movie and I'm not very nice to him. And I felt <laughs> bad about it. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe you can make up for it in real life. Uh, Jennifer Robertson, such a pleasure to have you with us, and congrats on being part of Netflix's history-making rom-com film. Take care. Thanks for having me. Take care.